and a Merry Christmas to everybody. This is the Monday before Christmas and I thought I'd be a bit cheeky on my health tips and well-being, which I've been doing for years now, and jump on the back of the Queen's speech because you're, you may or may not listen to it, but I think it's three o'clock on Wednesday. There'll be the Queen's speech talking all about respect of the planet, respect of each other, making sure that we are kind and considerate and help make the world a better place, be more mindful of how we are and what we do, seems to be the theme that she puts out there. And when you think she's in her late 90s, well, if that's not an example of somebody, and I know people may say that, well, she's got the money and gets all the care, but looking after herself doesn't have to cost lots of money. And there's lots of little things that we can do to self-care. So my message this twenty at the end of this 2019 and this Christmas is to make sure that self-care is at the top of your list over Christmas, particularly when there's stressful situations where we have high expectations, don't we? And this is going to happen and we want it like that, we want it perfect. And it doesn't always pan out like that. So go with the flow over Christmas. Enjoy the parts that you know are important for you uh, make sure you get a little bit of rest overindulgence isn't something i think that we want to do and every year we seem to do it it's uh, something that i know a lot of my clients come and they say drunk too much i ate too much i didn't take care of myself i'm too stressed you know maybe just in moderation you know everything in moderation it's there to be enjoyed all the beautiful food so don't abuse it enjoy it and I hope you have a lovely time whatever you're doing whether it be family or friends or even on your own a friend of mine is looking forward to having a beautiful walk on Christmas day and breakfast a beautiful breakfast on her own she's really quite looking forward to it she has family that she can be with but she's chosen to be with them for only a little bit of the day so make sure that as you head on into 2020 that self-care is something that you want to put at the top of the list. If I'm in great shape and really good health, then that has a massive knock-on effect to the world. So I wish you a beautiful, wonderful Christmas with what you're doing. I'm going to be with my new granddaughter and my family, and I'm going to have a bit of rest, a bit of work, and a bit of play. So incorporate the play part and have some fun. Merry Christmas to you all.